TrueNAS Core is a powerful and flexible network attached storage software that makes it easy for users and devices to access and share data through virtually any protocol. In this video, we're going to walk you through building the installation media for TrueNAS Core from start to finish. Ready? Let's get to it. The first stop is to head over to the TrueNAS website to download the installation media to build our install stick. Open up your browser of choice and head over to www.truenas.com. At the top on the far right, hover over Get TrueNAS and then click Download TrueNAS Core. We have a fantastic newsletter that we encourage you to sign up for. It's quick and easy and you'll get monthly community updates, hardware recommendations, priority security updates, exclusive TrueNAS specials, and so much more. If you're already subscribed to our newsletter, just click the No Thank You, I've Already Signed Up link below to continue on. This is a good time to review the minimum requirements for TrueNAS Core on the left. If everything looks good, click the Download Now button on the right to start the download. The download will take a few minutes to complete, depending on your internet connection speed. In the meantime, at the bottom of the download page, we have a video to help you walk through the installation process, links to our extensive documentation and forums, as well as our social media sites. Okay, now that the download is completed, let's build our install stick. We'll be building a USB install stick on Windows, and your USB flash stick needs to be at least one gigabyte in size or larger. There are a variety of different ISO to USB tools out there to help you build install media, and in this video, we'll be using Rufus. Rufus is free and open source and is the perfect tool for the task. You'll find a link to download Rufus in the description below. All right, start Rufus and insert your target USB stick into your PC. In the device section, Rufus will auto-select the USB device if it's the only removable disk inserted into your PC. If your USB stick is not listed or another device is shown, click the down arrow and select the correct disk from the list. Next, we need to select the TrueNAS Core install ISO file we just downloaded from the website. Click Select under the Boot section, navigate and select the Install ISO, and click Open. If you receive a pop-up regarding ISO hybrid image detected, click OK to continue. Alright, let's build this boot stick. Click Start on the bottom right to start the process. One more notification before we get started. This process will destroy any data that resides on the USB stick. If you have data you need to save, make sure you've copied it off the stick before continuing. If you're ready to build, click OK. And off we go. The process can take a while depending on the type of USB stick you've chosen, interface speed, and your computer, so let the process complete. Congratulations! Now that the process is finished, you can pull the USB stick from your computer, insert it into your target hardware for the TrueNAS Core install, boot from it, and get installing. This is a great time to mention that we have a ton of videos, documentation, and more to help you be successful with your TrueNAS installation. We highly recommend you check out the docs in the community forums to get the most out of TrueNAS Core. Thanks for watching.